This is Aaron True, MMA Prime TV, here with Todd Norman. He's from Cutting Edge Sports Training, directly next door to Rain MMA. You've worked with a lot of notable MMA fighters, Anderson Silva, Noguera, uh, Mark Munoz. Now you're working with Shogun. Can you tell us a little bit about your training background and uh, what you do for these guys? Yeah, uh, my background, I got a master's degree in kinesiology, and uh, I've been training athletes for about 15 years. And I've been training fighters uh, probably for about six years or so. My first uh, fighter I worked with was uh, Babalu and uh, still working with him today. But I've had the great opportunity to work with some, some great athletes, uh, you know, outside MMA like Mark Sanchez and Lindsey Davenport. And I used to be the strength coach for uh, the Anaheim Ducks hockey team. Um, so I have a, a real vast experience in working with athletes and uh, now I'm working with Shogun right now, getting him ready to fight Forrest Griffin. Well, that's what we wanted to ask you about today is the Shogun fight. Shogun is known for incredible heart, incredible power. If there's ever been a weakness people could even bring up, it would possibly be his cardio. What are you doing to prepare him for this rematch against Forrest Griffin and to make sure he's in incredible shape? Well, the one thing that I do uh, first and foremost with these guys is, is really work on core strength and stability because a lot of the movements that they have to, to uh, get out of or get into require uh, rotational strength and power. So core is kind of the foundation of what I do with these guys. Then we get into all the athletic development training like foot speed, agility, and reaction, which is something a lot of these guys haven't had. They've, they've done a lot of striking and kicking and, and their MMA techniques, but when it comes to just pure athleticism, in coordination, uh, I try to get that foundation underneath them first. And um, once once we've kind of built the athlete, then we got to start curtailing it more towards fight-specific training from a strength and conditioning standpoint. So with Shogun right now, uh, you know, we're now getting in that phase where we are starting to work on more cardio and conditioning and make it more fight-specific. At the same time, I'm still working strength and power and core and reaction and just kind of putting it all together. So by the time he gets to that fight, you know, hopefully the, the conditioning aspect of it isn't going to be an issue. Well, your guys like Mark Minos are known for their incredible power and cardio. Uh, how would you rate Shogun as a student so far? Um, Shogun's, you know, another unbelievable athlete that, you know, I've had the great opportunity to work with. Uh, Mark Munoz is someone that uh, you, you really almost can't compare someone to his, his conditioning and his, his, his work ethic, his will um, to, to just overcome and train hard and, and do whatever it takes uh, is it, pretty much unmatchable. Um, but, you know, Shogun, he's right up there with his work ethic and, and determination and uh, he's really given me kind of the autonomy to uh, just take over and get him ready for this fight. So, um, with that being said, uh, you know, we're doing everything we can. At the same time, you got to be careful not to overtrain these guys, you know, because they're trying to do their MMA stuff and, and, and you know, the Muay Thai and stuff like that. So, um, I got to be careful, you know, because next thing you know, somebody pulls a muscle or you know, can't train well and, and it's got to be a balance. So d because of that, do you ever work closely with his other coaches like Rafael Cordero or with the guys like Ryan Parson, uh, Jacob, you know, Marcel at Rain MMA? Do you guys all work together to make sure everyone's on the same page? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, within my facility, since I'm right next door to Mark Munoz, uh, fortunate to have like Ryan Parsons around all the time and, and other great fighters and, I, you know, working with Anderson and O'Gara and all these guys, you know, I've, you know, they've put me in ankle locks and chokes and so they've kind of given me the lessons of how things are and so I learned from them. Just yesterday when I was training Shogun uh, in a good fight specific uh, circuit training workout, uh, Master Rafael uh, was watching me and he, he was telling me that there's a certain move that Shogun needs to work on and uh, I immediately incorporated it into a drill and it was awesome. So definitely working with these guys in conjunction. Lastly, let's get your prediction for the fight. You know, you're working with Shogun. He has a huge rematch against Forrest Griffin. Uh, give us your prediction. You know, the only thing I'm going to say is that, you know, uh, you know, when I'm training someone for a fight or for whatever it is, it's 100% you're going to win and you're going to dominate. And, that, and that's the way it is, you know. So the mindset can't be any other way, you know. I, I think the athlete or the fighter has got to believe in themselves, and I think that whoever's working with them has got to be 100% believing in them, and that's the way I am. So to me, 100% um, Shogun's going to rip them up, tear them apart.